Hey, Francesca. I am Sheila Erickson. I work in the furniture industry in marketing and e-commerce. And I have a question for you. Um, there have been so many incredible, unique Oreo flavors, and they just keep coming one after another. I am wondering when do you get to the point of saturation um, and how you work to make sure that each flavor is still interesting and incremental and going to drive a great consumer experience. Hey, Sheila. A great question. And what you will notice is that we have a ton of limited editions and as well as seasonal flavors that we will often repeat year over year. And as we monitor our social platform, we see tremendous amount of, of engagement with these new limited editions and um, they they gain a lot of excitement sometimes they do better than others um, but often we'll even get requests for old flavors to come back and so sometimes we'll make decisions to bring them back i don't think in our world we think there's a saturation point because having some new and different ideas out there might source a future innovation something that will actually, you know, may evolve and become something that's a permanent addition. Some of them have become that for us. And we just see it as part of the brand, the brand's purpose and is to come up with new and different ways to engage with our brand.